And now, it's time to learn about some must-see places to visit here in the Holy Land, speaking of Jerusalem and other amazing locations that even Israelis don't always know about. They're brought to you by Visit to Israel, and joining us is Israeli tour guide Eliana Pesentin to tell us all about it. Eliana, thank you so much for being with us today. I'm so excited to hear about what we have uh, to learn about in store, so take us away. Thank you for having me. So the first site I'd like to tell you about is ancient Shiloh, Israel's first capital for 369 years before Jerusalem. We're going back 3,500 years in time. Today, ancient Chilo is an archaeological park and a national heritage site, just an hour from Jerusalem and an hour from Tel Aviv. It's right in the center of Israel, and it's a hidden gem. So why is it a hidden gem, though? Because as you said, I mean, this is a historical landmark. This is something that has some significance even in the name to people who may not have been there. Why, why is it so significant? I think, well, it's so significant because it is the, the first capital city, the center of the 12 tribes, and also the place of Hannah's prayer. Hannah prayed for a child. She was blessed with Samuel, who becomes a prophet, and later anoints King David, who will build Jerusalem. So it's also a place of prayer. It's an archaeological site. You can come dig for a day. In May, we're having an archaeological <laughs> dig with Dr. Scott Stripling coming from the United States. So you may even find you some, just, some treasures. You're some definitely going to find treasures. And it's one of the only sites in Israel where you can actually come join wow. the archaeologists. That's amazing. There's also incredible multimedia. Uh, there's a movie that you look through the windows, and the tabernacle is superimposed on the actual site which is amazing, augmented reality and... At its best. All right, well, unfortunately, we have to move on. What is our second location? And I understand that we're, again, looking in Judea and Samaria. Yes, so 20 minutes north of Jerusalem in Kohava Shachar is Adva Natural Soaps. It is a beautiful boutique factory for handmade soaps. They use essential oils and natural herbs. They go picking them out in the wow. fields and Dead Sea Mud. But the special story behind, besides the fragrance and the beauty, is the story. Shlomo Keshet uh, has a son, El Natan, with Down syndrome. And when El Natan grew up, he asked himself, what is El Natan going to do with his life? So he established this factory for El Natan and his friends to work. Most of the workers there are special needs. They get up in the morning. They have purpose in their life, a great place to come and work. And when you walk in, besides the fragrance, you see the beautiful smiles of these young adults. And purchasing the soaps and visiting the factory, you're giving back to the community. And it's really a unique experience. What an incredible like mission statement you know, to, to have, to hold, it's and, and really, to, to promote that sort of... It's unbelievable. And you can come with families, wow. and, and they have workshops. And it's just it's one of the best places wow. to come visit in Israel. All right, well, Eliana, again, this is these are two of the most gorgeous places that uh, I cannot wait to visit. I mean, these images that we're seeing on screen are beautiful. Thank you so much for telling us all about Thank them. Thank you for having we'll me. See you next week. Okay. Bye.